There are so many leaders here. But do you even speak for your own people? High King, now is not the time for short-sightedness. Short? Well, I, I mean, uh, to only look out for one's own in these troubling times is the, the height of foolishness. Height? Teclas, what are you doing? No, I, I don't mean... They're misconstruing my... Okay, look, all I'm saying is that our petty squabbles are dwarfed by the enormity of... Uh, uh, they simply don't measure up to... Um, uh, what I mean is that this bickering will only stunt our... Oh, uh, uh, to make so many races work in, in harmony is certainly a, a tall order. Kill him! Shut him up! Enough! <laughs> Teclas, my office. No. I'm... I'm... I am so sorry. No, I fear. So, uh, Teclas, how do you think that went? I, I mean, not amazingly, but... Uh, they call each other short all the time! Wh why can't I say it? Teclas! You know fine well there's context in history here. I'm sorry to have to do this, but I'm sending you to sensitivity training. I'm not about to let the damned forces of chaos have the moral high ground. Torch Master, I ordered four Hell Cannons, yet you only have three. You've come up short. Short? I'm sorry. I realize my choice of words may have been insensitive, considering the diminutive stature of your people, which I well know has no bearing on your worth as warriors or as individuals. I will strive to do better and choose my words more carefully in the future. Thank you, Ever Chosen. We gladly accept your gracious apology. 